Dublin Marley here, back again, playing some more War on the Sea. I think this is episode 11. Playing this on Elite Elite. What we got down here? Interesting. Well, let's send something over there. You can't go wrong with. Let's mark that though, so we know there's ships there. All right. Just checking all the stuff. Ooh, I got stuff now. So I can manage cargo on this. And I'll leave that one empty. All right, so I got 10 and 14. Hmm, he could probably use some. He's pretty good. I think he's sitting at nine. Ooh. That guy could use some supply, definitely. Twenty two and fourteen. You know what? Let's just go. Down there and see if we can get this airfield back up. All right. And I got 22 points. What? No way. I love that weather. Well, I guess uh, I am not going to find this guy. Yeah, it doesn't work. We'll just try go down here and see what's up. Apparently, I'm not going to find that guy. All right, let's look at you. Keep bombing Singapore. Make my life just a little bit easier in the end. Should be uh, all right. Wow, fifty two command points. I guess uh, it's time to buy something. Uh, I don't have battle cruisers. 
That's a shame. What does a battleship cost me? 75 for a Congo, man. Man, that hurts. So these guys cost that. Well, I think we get one of these for sure. Look for two DDs. What, 16? I need something that costs seven, to be perfectly honest. There we go. Let's swap these two. And we'll swap these two. And then we'll swap that one. You know, there's a lot of stuff down here, so... Let's keep him down in that direction. sucks. Whoops. planes well at least I'll get this guy over here I only lost one too I'm just trying to make this circle smaller so when I invade, it'll be easier. I could send that guy over there to go bomb them, but that's not a big enough fleet. Time. During the daytime, it's kind of hard to uh, do, but at nighttime, you can go 2,000. Trying to look for all those things during the daytime. All those lovely convoys. Ships. Nice.
All right, so it's going north. So let's go like that. See, this is what I hate about this. Is they're going to take attack that and there's nothing I can do to defend it. That's why they need to have fighters there. Make life fair. All right. Well, at least we found this guy. Is a cruiser. We know what I'm going after. All right. Send five at the cruiser, which is totally probably not enough. And we'll send two at each of the little annoying destroyers. And I'm questioning myself already. You attack there. And you attack there. Always take the cruiser out. This game has such a lack of them that taking capital ships out will always just be a good idea. Not that a cruiser is a capital ship. Come on. Can't wait till I can afford a carrier. Oh no, he's turning towards me. Drop good, guys. Drop good. Pretty good. That should work. Wow, nothing. I think they both went underneath. I see state though. That better be enough to sink him. One loss, completely worth it. Well, look up these islands. Well, 
Not sure. I think the islands I'm thinking about are more up here, though. Good job. I saw ya. Just gotta get to that magic 200 number. I mean, I'll have Singapore and this done by 200. Maybe even this. But after I hit 200, I'll be able to build airfields. Weird. Probably the scout plane from that ship. What was that ship anyway? Yeah, what am I at? 95. The letter cruiser. Or Linder cruiser. Or whatever the hell they call that. They're not bad. It's the same convoy. Weird that they uh, triggered uh, my scout plane. Either way, get out of here. All right. Worry about this ship down here. There he is. Boom. Add up to the ship total. we got yeah don't care oh no a little itty bitty patrol boats all right I can pretty much go after everything I guess Let's figure this out. You two. You're going to go after this guy. They blow up pretty easy. We'll send one after you. We'll send two after the even harder to hit one. I'm going to go two and two.
Go get them, boys. Go get them. They're all turning, though. It's going to be crappy angles. It'll be very hard to hit. But there's not much you can do about that. So I think I figured out, like, this game, I'm just going to have to go real, real slow. There's no other way around it. The lack of command points just dictates it. That and the increase to build uh, air bases. Jeez, that's harsh. Alright. Nice, nice. That was bad. Nice. I got the crap boat. So the Americans survive. That was a good run. Assuming these last two sink, which should. I know the passenger liner ship just sucks for damage control. Oh yeah, he's burning good. Would have liked to have taken out the last one. Come on, just go down. There you go. Another 2% of the way there. These convoys seem awfully suicidal. I'm waiting for their big convoy. Want to find those battleships. Maybe that carrier they got. Maybe I should build some subs and go hunt them. Come on, give me another explosion. You're almost there. Mm. You know, with uh, the Dutch and the British having PT boats in the game, I would like to see the American PT boats somehow put into the game. The never sinking enemy. You're a critical, critical, right? No. 
Gotta watch it. One more explosion should do it. Just got old. There we go. Good job, guys. All right, let's RTB you back. It is. Let's see if we can launch this guy. Let's keep going after Singapore here. Whoa, what are you doing down here, little buddy? Um... Guess I can send you. I don't like you that close to me. Of course, I'm sure I'll get bombed now. That never ends well for me. All right. guys well let's just go for the rear guy let's see if we can get lucky with a hit here actually um are you guys gonna hit the mountain now nah, you're good In the original game, I did that quite often. And that kind of upset me. Planes just smacking into the side of the mountains. Here it doesn't happen very much. I don't know why. I think it's because after they bomb, they automatically go up to like 4,000 or something. Only those are... Bigger bombs. Not, not bad, actually. A little bit of flooding. Got some decent fire going. We might get lucky. Or not. Touche. All right, let's get out of here. RTB. Um, do I want to go after them with... That's that one guy. Two, two still. And they killed two of my guys. That's not bad, though. I do want to know how they launch planes afterwards. Or 
only good thing about these bombers is they are fast. Alright, go get them, boys. Ah, they're chasing the north guy. It doesn't matter, they're too fast. Their closing speed is like five knots, something like that. Yeah, he's going 262, and we're going 264. The math just don't work for them. Mm. That's why the mosquitoes in the Atlantic campaign are 100% broken. Because you can't shoot them down. They can literally just outrun your fighters for the most part. Alright, 1.7 hours. I really do want to know what these guys are trying to do here, though. That just seems like suicidal as all hell. See how they like getting tacked in the straight. Dive, boys, dive. It's going to be actually pretty hard to hit them. Four and four. All right, four for this guy. And four for the other guy. All right. And they're starting to turn. Probably will miss most of them. Nice sea state, though. That was probably not worth it. I mean, it probably was worth it, but... Just another percent down. Well, let's uh, troll down here, then go back north. It's kind of funny, they stopped uh, 
doing the attacks over here all of a sudden. I don't know why he just got caught there. Well, we'll drive you up to here, have you come back down, so on and so forth. Damn subs, man. got over here five let's just keep bombing them I saw you. Mm -hmm. Wow, lost three. That hurts. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to stop bombing for a while. Go get him, boys. Crappy sea state, though. Just give me one lucky shot. Should be over a hundred now, to be honest. That doesn't look very good. Well, I don't know, that one looks kind of all right. Now he's gonna go right between them all. That one's my only hope, and he's going to go faster. Well, shoot. Lucky bastard. You go north, you can run into my uh, cruiser. That'd be fun.
All right, RTB. The only thing I'm worried about is running into airplanes from down here. Maybe they can reach me too. Miss something here. So I get for not paying attention. There we go. It'd be nice if I could get another cruiser. I think it's that same convoy. It is. All right, I got nine, so. Let's send two at the first guy. We're gonna send three at the four stacker. Two and two. Go get them, boys. What's crazy is you see people having like problems on like not so much this one but on the Indian Ocean British people are just too aggressive if you just slow play the British game it's pretty easy Uh, don't pass underneath them and don't get shot down uh oh that sucks wow that sucks only two hits Pretty bad. Mm. Let's see if we get a sinkage here. Mm. I think the merchant ship mm. will go. This guy. Mm, I can't tell. He's going pretty slow, though. Maybe he'll grace me with a magazine explosion. What's crazy is I've had more magazine explosions in this game than most of my other games. Those destroyers of mine, they just go down. Come on, sink. Mm-hmm. 
I'm always kind of curious why some ships have like four stacks, some ships have two stacks. I wonder what the advantage is of the extra stacks. Yeah, you're not dying on me. You might die though. Because you can always combine the stacks with uh, boilers and whatnot. Alright, return to base. Might have to send you back down there for that. You're going there, got it. See if we can catch that guy. He doesn't get a lot of work done over there anyway. Whoa. That's a CA. Of course. That's 600. Well, I mean, it's probably going to go that way. So we'll take you that way. We'll go with the big APs. Do not like that guy being down there. Really all I can send at it. I think he's going that yeah he's going off that way so let's uh adjust this a little bit i want my heavy cruiser How dare you? It's like they always have to strategic bomb me when I'm busy. All right, let's mark you on the map. Probably about an hour for those other guys, so this should be good. Alright, let's see what we got. Ooh. 
So what is this? I don't think that's a cruiser. So I think we just go all after this Omaha, the Marblehead. I mean, these are 1,600 pound bombs, so. A couple direct hits is gonna make this a bad day for this guy. What's funny is they didn't even drop off troops. So I don't have no idea why they even went that way. Not that this is a good uh, cruiser. Those casemate guns are just a horrible idea. There we go. Come on, give me another hit. Or not. Yeah, at least to make him go back to the repair shop. But I still have 18 torpedo planes heading this way, so. Damn. Mm. Pretty good, pretty good mm. flooding on that bomb. Man, if I would have got two hits, I might have sank him. Only shot down one, so that's survivable. Mm -hmm. But theoretically, I can only replace, what, five planes a day? Mm -hmm. Or five planes a week. You gotta be shit me. They didn't decide to engage before. I forgot all about them up there. You guys better shoot them all down. Like that they're already like trailing smoke. I would like to see strategic bombing redone. I'd like to see like a small little fake base or something. And if the planes don't get there to bomb it and you they turn around and leave the engagement area, they can't strategic bomb that time.
Good job, guys. Get him, boys. Guy's a survivor. He's smoking pretty heavy. You guys screwed up. It was mainly me screwing up, though. Yeah, they're at 32. Must pay attention to that better. Totally gonna eat that bombing. All right, what's your endurance? Well, that sucks. to eat that bombing too and those guys are going to engage those guys or not mm -hmm. uh, nothing I could do about that damn down to three base integrity all right That's tactical. All right, let's go this way. Turn right. Well, boys, you get the winner. and two or three after everyone else. Really just care about that cruiser though. And I'm hitting the opposite side, which is a plus. 
Should be good. I will say this is why you don't bring your uh Oh yeah, that looks all right. Ish. That wasn't good, but That doesn't sink him, I don't know what will. I feel cheated for not getting command points from cruisers though. Nice, nice. That's a rip. Who are you? Well, this is not good. for himself now. make it fairly difficult for him. Still going to be worth it. Killing a, killing a cruiser, always worth it in this game. We'll see what that does. Mm. Well, you're sinking. Oh, yeah, you don't look too good. That's what I'm talking about. Holy crap. I wonder where they get all these fighters from. And they look like all the same type of fighters too. Mm. 
Let's uh, start the timer. What a mess. These guys will probably escape. Not so sure about these guys. Or this guy. Gonna have to maybe adjust some uh, stuff mm. up north. I think I'm gonna take some supply from a. Uh, like, this place doesn't need 44 and 40 fuel mm. for the seaplane base. Five, it's a lot. Mm. What? I don't know what happened to over there. I didn't even know this guy got hit. This might be better than I thought. I had mm. to have been the Omaha. Or Marblehead or whatever one it is. Probably mm. the Marblehead. I might get lucky on these two guys. Or not. All right, let's just end it. Let's see here. Yeah, two and eight, two and ten. Definitely need some up there. So I'm going to drop the supply off here and pick up some. You're going to continue doing your thing and you're going to hope to get into a fight down here even though you don't ever see anybody. Kind of disappointed in that actually. Good for you guys. Let's get you back up north and we'll see what we can grab. Probably throw some more troops down here. Of course. see what this is
All right. All right, let's break you off. Since you're actually valuable. And let's we'll see what this goes for you. It'd be nice to get a submarine. I mean, they're suicidally attacking nothing but sub chasers here. see what we got please be no star shells all right we're good on that hopefully Crazy that no one's picking up a sub here. Uh, those are torpedoes. All right. Let's break. Floor it. Hard left. You should be seeing one somewhere over here. So let's drop you a little bit. Let's go back to a guy who's about ready to get killed. Are they going away from me? Oh, they're going away from me. You go that way go slow you break floor it and go hard right because they're coming from behind you Well, he should be right here. There we are. All right, you go after him. Full speed attack. I love that we can identify the subs just so easily. Like, I don't think sonar was that good that they could identify various subtypes just through sound already. I don't know, I'm not a sonar guy, but this is World War II. Come on. Let's go get them, guys. Wow, they're so slow. Mm -hmm. 
I don't know how we're missing him. Come on. Sub warfare always takes so long. You know it's crazy though? I'd like to see a game mechanic where the more supply ships you're sinking, like let's say the Pacific campaign, if you can sink supply ships coming from America, you can affect how much supplies they're actually getting. So the computer would just be shit out of luck if you're running a, a very effective uh, sub campaign. Yeah, I don't think you're a very smart guy. Wow, it's... There we go. How did that work? Heavy, heavy? Give him another, give him another dose of reality. Go get him, boys. There's some brave sub captains, though. I mean, sure, you gotta go where the boats are at, but. I don't think I'm making an attack if I don't have my max diving depth available to me. Because you have to think about it like is getting sunk more valuable to the enemy than you sinking one of their ships. Because that sub could go on to sink another 20, 30 ships. So it comes down to like loss reward thing. Probably sinking a ship is not as valuable as preserving combat power. I don't know. I'm sure the admirals have a different opinion. Now I just hope these guys don't get hit by uh, air power. They shouldn't though. we got down there let's go give him a little visit actually he's going north let's just do that
you return to base. I want to make sure I have seven up there now that I'm kind of screwed. <laughs> well, shoot. Something like that. What's funny is I might have to adjust my uh, fighters over there doing their patrols. I don't think they're doing a very good job. What we got? Oh, a three stacker. And it's the cruisers. That's weird. So two, two, and two. That works for me. It's kind of weird they made it all the way over here. Sometimes I think the computer cheats on the distance. What's the C state? Six, uh, probably missing. Well, get lucky, boys. Alright, little three destroyers. Why don't you come up to cruiser land and see how it works for you? Probably think my destroyers is par for the course, but it is what it is. RTBU. I have a feeling they're going north. So let's go, uh, let's go give them a, a welcoming committee. Something like that. on any of them. I'm not sure what you are, but I don't think you're the most dangerous. Well, 
Oh shit, you might be the most dangerous actually. Either way, damaging this guy up will be good. That was not good. I guess we'll leave him for uh, the cruisers. And it's 12. So I got what? RTB. I guess I could send you down here. It's four and a half. That's good. All right. Not doing too shabby. I will be right back in one second. See something right there? I got nothing better to do. Tactical you up. Let's see if I can get me a nice little uh little kill. All right, go get him, boys.
one hit should take these guys out. It's good too because I don't want to play hide and go seek with these guys. That would be boring. close. I want a two engine plane like an A-10 Warthog bunch of 30 millimeter cannons just go in and shred these ships and yeah, we'll do like something like that and then start running Stay away from the uh, Air Australia down here. Alright, let's see if I can manage this guy's cargo. Nope, not yet. Let's just drop off. We'll drop off that to you. That's probably good. and 24 we'll do that so 12 and 8 and yeah we need to go north and save this guy so we'll go up here and drop off there You gotta be shitting me. It's actually kind of amazing. Let's check over here. Still at four. I'm gonna let you grow. All right, five ships.
Really want the cruisers though. see what this is uh probably going north ignore and you go back up there because i don't know where that guy went Kind of bull crap. This guy's not gonna get in a fight. There we go. Yep, it's them. C State 5, that's a plus. Go get him, boys. Could be a bad angle for this guy. Very bad angle. Shooting my guys down. Wow, that's actually kind of hurting. Oh, <laughs> the two duds hurts, that's for sure. Too good. Yep, nothing. I mean, too wounded, but still. That is not, mm. not what I needed. Mm. All right. RTB. Let's take a look at enemy losses real quick. 104. I wish you could sort by class and type. That would make my life so much easier.
These little annoying bastards. Like the way they're maneuvering, though. So hard to hit these guys with torpedo bombers. But if they get hit by one, they die. That is a good thing. Ooh, it looks pretty good. Oh, yeah. dead good job guys and the more important thing no freaking losses see what is that It's not heading to me. It's going up here. That's just weird, man. It makes me think there's like something there. I'll leave that guy. Ooh, he's getting short too. I think these are the 17s. Yep, of course it's these guys. And six, then
Oh, are you shooting my Oscars down? There we go. Damn. That's not even fair, man. Come on. Damn, they're just tearing me my Oscars up. Well, they might take this place down from a level 3 to a 2. And I definitely don't have the points to build. Oh, these guys look perfect. Not good, not good. Oh, that guy's smoking. That needs to be your target. Not you, you moron. The other guy. I swear my pilots are dumb. Might as well go after the one smoking. God, they're going 260. So I have an 8 knot closing speed. Might just have to suck it up and take the debt, take the loss here. Good job. Definitely helps. Wow, these guys just got tore up. That's why I hate B-17s, man. Too much defensive firepower. Oh yeah, you're out of the circle. We'll just end this. 
enough of this. Got a three base integrity. Hopefully, they take the port. I can live without that port. No, they took the airfield. Son of a bitch. <coughs> oh well. When I have triple, when I have open sea lanes, that won't be a problem to rebuild. Probably be a problem to be rebuild right now, though. That probably stops me bombing this place. Where these guys get frozen. I'm just trying to get a good naval fight over here, guys. Out of range of everything but this place, which I don't think they can only launch one thing. They're not too scary. I think maybe the objectives need to change. Like, they don't attack this base that often, or this base, or this one even. I mean, they'll strategic bomb them, but... These two bases would probably be the first places they bomb, or they take over, just to make their supply lines easier. Come on, let's find Task Force Z. I saw that. I'm running out on this guy too. Let's take a look at my rest and repair. Oh yeah one day for that heavy cruiser that is pretty sweet and I've got three destroyers two cruisers all right I got pretty decent amount in the Hawk Interesting. Let's form up. I don't see any shells. 
They gotta be south of me, though. Let's just kind of go that way. And you guys... You guys kind of just go this way. And let's, uh... Let's slow you two up a little bit. I don't want you going too fast. But let's take a look. No, let's not take a look north, because I don't think they're north. Interesting. I have a feeling it's that one ship. Well, something is here. No splashes, no nothing. Launch my uh, scout planes. All right, let's uh, launch a plane. No bombs. Just go this way, and we'll have you do a circle. You can go this way, and you too. go this way.
All right. What do we got? Okay, it's that little ship boat. All right, screw this. Come on, boys. Make this a quick kill. All right, that's a little better. Come on, someone just give me a splash right down the middle. Poor guys. The destroyer will probably take more damage than the ship does. That's how it goes. So what's that? It looks like some type of cable reel. Did they have trolling sonar at that point? No. insanely brave ship.
There we go. I mean, 10,000 yards, guys. our accuracy. Wasting entirely too many shells here. A little bit of damage goes a long way with these guys. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, he's toast. Good job. Good job, boys. All right. Now that means you need to run away because the idiots are going to come and bomb you. One oh seven. We're moving right along on this. I think I'm gonna cut it short here. Thanks for joining me. Please like, subscribe, follow, and friend. But I am out of here. I think the overall strategy is to continue keeping all this alive. Build up troop strength. I got twenty thousand here. I'm sending all these troops to reinforce these three because these are the only three they seem to invade. And just keep these two airfields and this airfield alive. And to be honest, I've got two Mavs there right now. So, got a little bit of extra firepower now. And I think I'll be fine. And then I think I just go invade Singapore whenever I have a chance. As I build up weekly combat power. So I get 25 back tomorrow. Which I'm going to buy another heavy cruiser so these guys can just demolish those crappy convoys. And then I'll probably turn them all in. Wait till they all come back and boom, brand new ships to go bombard this place. Alright, later all.